video I want to talk about M's and W's uh, when they happen. Many of you uh, have asked me uh, when uh, these uh, M shapes and uh, W shapes uh, happens in the market and how, how do we spot them when they happen and all that. To be honest with you, uh, it's a very difficult question. I don't know when they happened, but you have to understand uh, that the market will give you the clue uh, on when they happened. Okay, let me give you a, give you an example. We have a uh, our a Asian session price uh, is in consolidation, small moves here. Okay, we are closing to the London session here. Suddenly, you see the move: one push, little push here, second push, one push here, and this push. Okay, and a big wick price comes down, stops. Okay, this. Uh, indicates that you have your false move okay you have your false move and maybe the price will uh, push back down okay stops here somewhere push backs up okay and um, right here you can assume that the that the market gives you the first leg here for the M because price is going up and the M's always shaping so, uh, like this M's can be like this M's can be like this this scenario is a perfect scenario because all the buyers are get hostage here market makers push the price right under this price and holds it and then boom come down but in this scenario the buyers are here market makers push the price down here push the price higher up stops here and then come down another scenario is that when the market makers push the price here stops push it one more time stop come down and push it for the last time up and when they push it for the three, third time you got them you don't have to think that oh this is not an M if you see three pushes just forget about the first one and act from the second one okay and this is the perfect M because you have three pushes to the upside, okay? So price comes in the consolidation, very boring movement, suddenly come, down, come up, all right? And then they stop and you have something like this. This is what you see. When you see this kind of shape, you have your clues. You have your first leg, you have your bottom leg of, of the M, and, you, and here you have to be in alert when the, when the market gives you the right uh, candlestick pattern. From here, it's all about price action. If in this area, for example, uh, you see the price comes up and gives you some big wicks here, okay? And then they come here, they give you some big wicks here. When they come up here, okay? The next candle here, for example, this is uh, this is this should be a uh, for example this is a green candle the next candle for example opens here is a red candle and it's a railroad track comes down and maybe you get some doges here and the next one here from here you can just enter all right let me jump to the chart I can show you in the chart what I mean okay Right uh, now, here for example, uh, you can see that you have your M here. Price comes all the way here. This is happened. Price stops here. This is happened. And price stops here again. And price comes here. And you're watching the price like this. This is the shape of the M because the price is going up. Gives you the first leg, bottom, and the top leg is starting. And he, from here, you can just get in for the sell. All right, maybe the price uh, comes down, do one more push up, but it doesn't matter. It will come down, right? Uh, let me show you a, um, for example, in this scenario, you don't have any clear uh, M's in the top. They don't happen every time, okay? Uh, let me see. This example here is a perfect example here, what I just told you here price shoots up very nice pin bar here 
stops here comes down about 20 25 percent down shoots up again to the to the to this area under this level comes down you say okay i got my m but this happens don't have to be scared of this this is a railroad trace a perfect scenario if third time if third time happens here just forget about this one you have your m here okay this is the lesson of m's and uh let me oh and another thing that uh, you have to be aware of is that usually you get something about 40 50 60 pips run and then and then these things happens sometimes it goes about 70 to 80 pips but you cannot uh, do any assumption and uh, you have to wait to see this area happens i mean you have to see this move you have to see this move this action should happen for you in order to for you to decide uh, for a shape of the m you cannot just say where is the m the m is just shaping the market is giving it to you all right um and let me um see if there is any uh, w scenario here not many w, w scenario here because the price is just going up and uh, we let me see if there is anything here no not much uh of a w is here in the bottom no one is one is here one little one here is you know uh, as the price is coming down shapes this leg goes up let me change the color you can see it better comes here goes up and comes here none of this is happened when you see this shape this is your shape first leg is here second leg and you have to just enter here for the for the second leg right the m shape comes up comes down comes up this is what you see your expectation is that the second leg is uh, happening here and coming down i hope you like this presentation for m's and w's if you're not subscribed to my channel subscribe please hit the like button have a nice day bye